dumb vibes is here to entertain you. So far, as far as this week's trends are concerned, King Swati being alleged to have actually claimed the life of our beautiful and gorgeous Hilary Gardi has been taking us aback as Hilary Gardi's father Godrich Gardi has not decided to back off completely from this case. He has actually been accusing King Swati for no just cause without any visible proof yet. And of course, Kim Swati has decided to voice out some bitter truths as he has alleged that King Swati himself is very much innocent and Godrich Gardi should finally confess because he is the one who might definitely have claimed the life of his own daughter. I personally feel so sad when I listen to all the havoc that is being caused due to this particular problem. Do well to watch this video because I'm having some juicy information and I'm about to spill the tea while it's still hot. Before I do so, you're welcome to my YouTube channel. Kindly subscribe to this YouTube channel, like this video, drop a comment after watching the entire video and hit on to my post notification bell. Kim Swati of Swaziland was the subject of Godrich Gardi's Twitter feed a few weeks ago. His daughter Hilary Gardi passed on to glory because of some unforeseen circumstances and of course Godrich has been acclaiming, blaming and accusing King Swati for being responsible for claiming the life of his very beautiful and eloquent daughter. A robbery decoy was used by the King's Foreign Intelligence Service who then shot and claimed the life of Hilary Gardi, says Godrich Gardi. In response to all of what has been going on on social media, especially as far as what Godrich said about Mswati, he actually issued a statement of his own. Mr. Godrich should ask Hilary Gardi's mother, who actually claimed the life of their daughter, says King Swati III. In the wake of Swati's statement, Godrich has remained completely silent and of course, he has had nothing to say about this. Several people claim to believe that at some extent, this, there is some truth in what he has actually revealed. What did Swati actually do to Godrich? Swati said that the South African Broadcasting Corporation decision to air a tweet from a lunatic without verifying it was a very terrible example of journalism after he reviewed and saw that several people have been talking about this particular case. Some people actually even believe that the main reason why Godrich Gardi hasn't spoken yet is simply because of the fact that Hilary's mother is no longer alive and of course we still don't actually know why he is silent as far as the principal reason is concerned. One of Julius Malema's henchmen is no other person than Godrich Gardi as to what revealed King Swati on a public statement. He questioned Godrich's intentions when he asked, are the allegations he's making part of the investigation or are they made up to see the video about this, you can actually see it online. Gardish Gardi, in my opinion, needs to be very much more careful with the way he actually voices out allegations and blamings. As far as Kim Swati is concerned, Kim Swati is a man of honor. He is a great monarch who is respected by so many people all over the nation and as well by neighboring nations. And of course, bringing up such allegations about Kim Swati is very much, you know, dangerous already to some extent. But I understand that he is grieving and he is going through a whole lot right now. But still, yeah saying such things about the king monarch is so much of a do already i don't want to be so judgmental about this case because they definitely know where they are coming from they know what they are handling as far as this particular case is concerned as god receiving review of that all this was due to political situations and it all came as a level of revenge but still yet we are waiting for a statement after king swati said what he said as far as hilary Gard is concerned do well to watch this video and do well to drop a comment. Thanks very much. I love each and every one of you.